Okay, so Google has uh, made some changes again, so we need to do a new video to show how to find an image. Uh, this can be done if you are searching for images for eBay or for your website. Um, search for the product that you need the image for. So whatever your product is, for example, if I wanted to find the ViperSharp product, then uh, I'll do a search for ViperSharp. Okay, and then I want to see only images, so I'm going to come, um, well, it doesn't even give me an option for images, so I might have to type in images there. And there we've got images option, right? So we click on images, and that'll show us just images of the products. But we want to get large images, so we'll go click tools here, which is bound to change before too long in the future here. And then over here we've got size, and we can go large, medium, or larger than a certain size. So if we want certain size, we can do that. So if we just want to look for large images, then we can get uh, our images there. As we hover over each of the images here, you'll see a size indication. So this one says it's 1500 by 844 um, pixels. So that's a pretty good size image. However, that is not this small image. This small image that we're looking at here, each of these, these are called thumbnail images. The thumbnails are not what you want to download, so you do not want to download that. Instead, you click on that, left click on that image to pull up this box, and when you see this window, that is the larger image. Now you can right click and go down to Save Image As. Now I'm on a Mac and using Chrome here, and so these are the options I have. Uh, you should always be using Chrome. You should see something that says Save Image As. If you're using another browser or a uh, different setup, you might see Save Image As, or, or I'm sorry, Save Picture As instead of Save Im Image As. We do not want a Save As option. The Save As option is going to save a web file um, not just the image. So you must be looking for, again, right click on the image and find save image as or save picture as. It must be specified that way. And you click it to save and then choose where you're going to save it. Um, you've got the name of it up here. Um, you'll have either up here or down at the bottom somewhere depending on your computer where you're going to save it to. You've got all these options over here. You can choose what folder to save it to what you're going to name it, and then click Save. And that is the best way, the quickest and easiest way to get good size images for either your website or eBay, images that will be large enough to enlarge and give customers a good view.